Hello again, welcome back. This is part 7 of Let's Play the Xenosaga series. At the end of part 6, we ended up getting swallowed up by a giant gnosis known as the Cathedral Ship. So we are going to make our way through this and see what happens. Alright, what do we have here? We have an antidote. We obtained Nightwalker. I'm not sure what that does. Let's take a look. Nightwalker prevents sleep. That's useful. Actually, you know what else I want to do? Let's... Let's replace Ziggy with... Well, if I can do this correctly without screwing it up. Let's replace Ziggy with Kosnos, because I always like to have Kosnos in my party. And... Let's get a new save slot going. Alright. If I remember correctly, between the level and the cutscenes, this is a pretty lengthy area of the game, so I don't know if we're going to get through the whole thing in this episode. Alright, come on, dude. Okay, one thing that I forgot to do last time was Xion and Kosnos each learn new tech attacks. I'm trying to remember how I set those up. Oh, probably under tech attacks. Okay, so we'll set Shot Blade there. And I believe Chaos. Chaos. Kosnos learned our drill. So let's set our drill there. Alright, there we go. Nice, let's go in circles. Obtain the biosphere. Always useful. I won't let anyone die. Some of my power! <laughs> 
anyone die. So this is a cathedral ship. It does feel like we're inside a ship, but it certainly doesn't look like anything that belongs to the Federation. Could it be an alien ship? I wonder. Look, over there. What is it? A sign or something? Hey, it's written in English. But this is odd. It doesn't look like it's stuck on the wall. Doesn't it look more like a part of the wall itself? Are you saying this sign is part of the Gnosis? I think she is. How could that be? Take a look around. That's not the only one. There's a lot of other stuff here too. Are we... really inside a Gnosis? Hurry! He'll be gone! What, did you find something? Huh? Uh, no. Uh, no, it, it's, it's nothing. That girl again. What does she have to do with this place? You could play a drinking game where every time Xi'an says, Oh no, it's nothing, you take a shot. You would get drunk pretty quickly. At this time, the defendant's origins are unknown. That information was lost in the chaos of war, perhaps deliberately, I might add. It could be said that the circumstances surrounding the defendant actually qualify him as a victim of the life recycling law. Therefore, is it right for him to be the first victim of a capital punishment system that had been abandoned for thousands of years? It's true that the defendant must pay for his crimes. But with all the progress we've made in science and the study of the human psyche, Surely there must be alternative means by which he can repay society? Please, I ask you to make a merciful and wise decision. This court hereby sentences the defendant, Andrew Cherenkov, to undergo level 7 personality reconditioning. With this ruling, the current you will cease to exist. But it also marks the birth of a brand new world for you. Let us celebrate, shall we? What is the meaning of this? Why can't we have a child of our own? Oh, stop it. What could you want to leave behind? Don't tell me you want that abnormal DNA of yours to live on. Nanotechnology is hardly perfect, you know. It still can't correct mutations in genomes. Are you saying this is my fault? <laughs> You're pathetic. A bit of nucleic acid desperately clinging to life. You haven't changed one bit since then. But of course, that's what makes you, you. But then... Why did you marry me? For this. Do you know how hard I worked for this permit? That's why I volunteered to care for you. What, did you think there was love between us? Please, don't kid yourself. I can get all the love I need with this. <clears throat> That's harsh. Don't forget to take your meds. After all, I'm the one who'll be held responsible if you don't. Why is she asking for it? I 
I don't think this is going to end well for her. Nailed it. Called it. In accordance with Federation law, the defendant will now undergo level 8 personality reconditioning. With this, Defendant 12584's human rights shall be revoked, and henceforth the defendant shall be treated as a life form belonging to the Federation. According to current law, this treatment grants the bearer the same rights and privileges as those of a realian. God, he just strangled the child to death. I must admit, I've never seen such a stubborn neural network. He's even rejected the level 8 procedure. In any case, he's still quite valuable to us. We can use him as a test subject for the level 9 procedure. So you're the man who murdered every worker in this facility, and annihilated three squads of Federation Special Forces. I was looking forward to meeting you. But you... You look like a poor little stray. Is this really your handiwork? Life recycling variant. No wonder the Federation police couldn't handle you. I'll commend you for that. However... <laughs> Reality is cruel, is it not? Commander Margulis, the 308th Volgata Division is... I know. We're taking him with us. Sir! You're not serious. Yes, this one may be useful. But... All you ever wanted in life was to leave behind a legacy. Isn't that right? Now show me the proof of your existence. To me alone. Back in control of Xion here. Uh, let's go this way first. Neurostim.
wouldn't let anyone die. Luckily, she unequipped that uh, accessory that prevents sleep, so she's immune to that. Ooh, times ten. Beautiful. So Chaos and Kosnos each leveled up. Very, very nice. Your orders, Xion? Heal these, heal these guys up. I don't want to go that way yet. There's a way to lure him down this way. Eh, I don't think so. Do you really think this is a good idea? Probably not.
this is going to be an annoyingly drawn out fight. If I took on those three minutes, that went on a little long. Alright, what is up here? Ah, treasure chest. What do we get? I think this is fire protection. Reduces fire type damage 20% and physical defense top plus 2. So, alright, we'll give that to Chaos. Let's see if there's anything over here. I don't think so. Nope. Alright, now we can go the other way. Thank you. 
Oh, Sheehan's almost dead. I should probably do something about that. Take it easy on me. I'm not meant for this line of work. Let's heal the knuckle again. Okay, we needed to break those for. Oh no, maybe we did. I thought we had to break those for some reason, but I guess we didn't have to. Let's see what's in here. Anything? Okay, Xi'an leveled up to 13, Chaos to 14, couple of Meg Kits, couple of Ether Packs. A revive. A cure all. And a revive DX. Alright, it looks like that's everything I can do up here, so let's go back down.
Nice, Shion. Okay, healed in up again. Let's head this way. And let's take this lift down. Aquari elevator, yes. Thought hopefully there was something to detonate here, but I guess not. I'll know her ether points back so we can heal again.
Alright. Just getting a little annoying here. Unleash some of thy powers! Wow, that took long enough. Over three minutes just for that fight. up above eventually, so I'm try to go in here first. All battle systems are go.
level 13 for Kosnos. Later in the game, your characters will each learn an attack that can hit the entire group of enemies and then those would come in handy now for fights like that that just tend to drag. But unfortunately, nobody gets one of those attacks until a little later. Okay, we got an ether pack S, we get a med kit S. I don't want to go that way just yet, I don't think. to go here first. I think there's something up here. Maybe. Yes, that is what I wanted to do. Okay. So now let's head back down. And I'm going to use a save state here just because I think I think this dude can be tough, I can't remember. Disabling auto safety. Destroy all targets. Come <laughs> on. 
some of thy powers. So it doesn't look like this guy's difficult, he's just annoying and has a lot of hit, hit points. He's down to 264, so we've almost got him taken care of, and he's almost got Xi'an taken care of, jeez. This to take care of him. Nope. I really want the bonus points. There we go. My external appearance is down five percent. Xion, I need to be clean. Okay, so we got a tech upgrade from him, that's not bad. And a tuned circuit. I think you equip those to your eggs? Oh yes, agility plus one. Gosh, did she use all her EP again already? Oh well, I've got enough either packs, it doesn't matter. Okay, that was the only thing over here. Alright, now we can go back up top and go to the next area.
Now because I'm using it, playing this on an emulator, I actually could speed this up a little bit. I'm trying not to do that. Here, dude. Get out of my way, or else. Let's see what's down below. Uh, I don't think I want to go that way first. I think I want to go this way first. It's, well, I take that back. Dead end.
Okay, I see a save point okay. just up ahead, and that's where I'm going to cut off this part, as I need to get ready for work. But first, let's take care of these guys. Okay, level 14 for Xion, and I honestly couldn't tell if that was Chaos or Kosnos that leveled up. I think it was Kosnos. Okay, this is going to do it for part 7. I um, didn't really do a whole lot of talking in this episode, but I'm going to chalk that up to the fact that I'm dead tired. Alright, let's buy one of these. I have no money at all. Damn. Oh well. Let's use a biosphere and heal everyone up. Okay, this is it for part 7. In part 8, we will finish off the cathedral ship. Maybe do a little extra since this episode was a little bit shorter than the other ones so far. I think the, this one just clocked in at an hour. Most of my other ones have gone between, I think, an hour and a half and two hours. So, like I said, next time we'll finish off the cathedral ship and see what happens after that. So, until then, take care. Goodbye.